Greetings, beloved beings of light. Hope you're having a most beautiful, blessed day. I wanted to share this little piece of heaven with all of you today. It's a beautiful day on the new earth. It's 73 degrees, perfect temperature, the sun shining bright, the Christo Sophia, the Christed energy is coming through fully today. I'm in this beautiful sacred portal here on Gaia, surrounded by beautiful evergreen trees. I'm going to do a 360 for all of you to see. I'm at this beautiful waterfall here in Washington. It's a glorious day. I a, was able to take a few minutes break to come out here to nature. You should get out into the beauty of nature. The new earth is fully shining through now. The smells, the scents out here are, is like great incense of the Great Mother. So we have these higher dimensional frequencies pouring in through this powerful portal. You know, every day is sacred. So I wanted to thank all of you again that continue to support us. Some of you month after month, year after year, we couldn't be doing this work without you. So we're very grateful for each and every one of you, that for those of, that have supported us over the years and those that continue to support us. You see, we're very close to our divine redemption, our divine dispensations, returning to our sacred land. So thank you for those that help us to carry us through and through and through with your energy, with your financial support and everything that you do for us. We're very grateful. Your rewards are coming beyond what you can imagine, not only in your relationships, but financially and your health, all these things that contribute to our wealth, our happiness, our joy. And once you reunite with your divine union, it'll be beyond what you can imagine. It will be your heart's delight. So we, we thank you for joining us on this great mission of full planetary li liberation you are very important as a star seed of the new earth to help the world awaken, to help our people awaken from the dream, from the illusion, from Maya. You see, we do this by living from our hearts, being real human beings, you know, feeling our connection with Mother Earth and all of her children of the sun. And we do this through our feeling, through our thoughts, through our emotions and staying positive through it all. I know many of you have suffered greatly, but we stay in the heart. We stay in the love and the truth, and we're very grateful for all the love that you share with us through your positive comments, through your beautiful love, your light, your joy. Thank you for sharing this journey with us. To really feel into these energies, there's so much beauty around us. I wish you could smell these sacred scents that Gaia is sending to me now. It's beautiful evergreen, these firs, these beautiful fir trees and these beautiful mosses. I'm going to show you here this beautiful vista that I'm seeing here. All of our children of the sun is down here swimming in these beautiful waters. This is glacial fed waters from our most beloved Mount St. Helens to the north, Helena bright shining light you are a bright shining light in the dark you know the valley of the shadow of death is being transformed into the valley of eternal life you know this is what we call our happy valley this is one of our beautiful valleys here with this sacred waterfalls and this beautiful glacial fed river here It's amazing, these colors, these beautiful colors. I'm going to show you now this beautiful vista that I'm standing over. And I'll share a couple more beautiful images with you so, so you can take on the energy of this little sacred piece of heaven here on Earth.
Now, could you feel your heart totally lighting up with the energy emanating from this beautiful, beautiful sacred portal on Mother Earth? We're feeling the heart chakra, middle Dantian, lighting up with the emerald green hue of our emerald covenant, our emerald ray and the blue rays coming in, the violet ray. We're combining all the seven colors of the electromagnetic spectrum of all our holy rays through our sacred vessel. You know, so allow the energy to move through you. you know, as our heart lights up, we're lighting up the heart of Gaia and the heart of the cosmos, the great central sun. It is all one and the same. We're all united. We are all linked. We're all connected. We're merging together in the Heros Gamos of the eagle and the condor with the mind and the heart coming together as one. So this is Gasho in Zen Buddhism. Gasho is the sacred prayer posture. This is a holy mudra. You see, the mudras are our hand postures. There's thousands of mudras, each one sacred, powerful, just as there are thousands of mantras. So the mantra is the holy word. The mudras are the sacred hand postures. So we have very many. We have many, many, many postures. It's the gold lotus flower energy. So the gold Buddha mind is being activated within every living heart of our true humans, our real humans that are here on Earth, our starseed Earth angelics of the 144 that are bringing compassion and kindness back to the world with our wisdom, our truth, our gnosis, our knowledge. We bring the knowledge of the divine masculine together with the wisdom of the divine feminine. You see, I'm surrounded here by our grandmothers. I lift our grandmothers and embrace them. In my arms, our holy grandmothers. All our elders are with us now, our elders from the past, present, and future coming together for this ascension, for this great mission upon Pachamama. <clears throat> So I'm going to take you further down the river here to a beautiful waterfall and show you some more magnificent vistas and views from different points here. These are powerful sacred portals. We feel the portals in our body. You know, they feel us, they help us anchor in, they bring us joy, they lift our spirits, bring peace, you know, to the kingdom of heaven within, to the stillness within.
Well, there you have it, beloved beings of light. Another beautiful, blessed day on the new earth. How about those young, crazy kids jumping off that cliff? Pretty wild. I told them, better them than me. <laughs> yeah, I used to do wild and crazy stuff when I was young, but those days are long over. So be sure to get out to nature. Have to get back to the grind here. Our, our website was attacked and taken down again by the dark forces. So I'll be working part of the day with my IT guy and getting our site back up and running. So that's why our website hasn't been updated in a couple days and why we haven't been able to send out our newsletter. But hopefully today we'll get that resolved. You see, even though we're on 5D New Earth, we're still confronted with challenges and obstacles because there's still interference patterns over 5D and we're resolving these day by day moment by moment by living in our joy and seeing this through and through and through so be sure to make this the best day ever because this is it inch time foot gem each moment is worth more than a priceless gem that's a zen mantra so you can use that daily to try to stay present to try to stay in this now moment and live from your heart walk the middle path of Buddha mind. Buddha mind is the awakened mind, the middle path, not too hot, not too cold, not too high, not too low, just right. We call the Goldilocks zone. So the gold is within the lock of the heart. This is the queen's chamber, the gold light. So when we merge the crystal palace and lower Dantian with the center of our sacred Merkaba, we light it up and with lighting up our Dantians and our physical vessel, we light up the grids. You're anchored in a very special portal, a very sacred portal. All our lands of Gaia are beautiful, are sacred, are holy ground. And when we walk with our bare feet on the earth, we talk, we touch, we touch the earth with our feet, the soles of our feet, and we transmit our love, blessings, and light to Gaia and all her children of the sun. Have a most beautiful, blessed day. The eagle and the condor love you all. Namaste. In la kecha la kina ho. Om Mani Padme Hum. Om Mani Padme Hum. Om Mani Padme Hum.